going on guys Booger here back with another video today I'm gonna to do a quick review over the Jordan 1 rookie of the years I dropped on Saturday um, I was able to secure mine at a local Foot Locker and the quality on these I think are really nice um they're a lot better than what I expected and um the prices are higher than what I expected as well when I look on like stock X and stuff so it seems like this shoe might be sought after a little bit somewhat I know small sizes were hard to find and a lot of people were buying anything under a size 10 because a lot of stores still had everything in the bigger sizes still left. But anyways, um, I'm going to get into the quick review and then I'm going to do a home foot. So stay tuned. All right. So you have your standard Air Jordan 1 box as always. Black and red Nike Jordan 1 box. And it reads Air Jordan 1 Retro High OG 555088-700. Um, it is Golden Harvest Black Sale. So just a retail of 160 And I got my size 8.5 as always. And that is the size I go with in the retro ones because they tend to fit big to me and going smaller and having them fit tight I like better and then when you look into the shoe the overall quality of these is really nice um it has your tumble leather all over and then it has a really good suede um so your mud guard around the toe box is covered in like that golden uh, harvest colorway which is like a wheat color and then you have your tumble leather toe box you have black laces a white tongue your side panel has that tumble leather as well as you can see with the black swoosh that is tumble leather also um on the back heel you got that golden harvest color on the ankle you have that with the black wings logo on the inside of these it does say on the left side it says this award is nice but i just feel it's very important for each individual to go out and contribute to his team um nj with the quote and then on the other flap 1984 through 85 rookie of year he scored 2313 points and he averaged 28.2 points per game that year and if i'm not mistaken the air jordan one came out in the year 85 so his first year he was going crazy um and that's just some little detail that is on each shoe um, on the insole, nothing too fancy. Just that golden harvest color with um, Nike Air and black. Your sole's black, your midsole's white. And then you do have that set of red laces. And with these, I'm kind of digging the red laces more. I'm normally not a guy who swaps out laces, but I've seen pictures of the red laces in these versus the black. And I think I like the black, or sorry, the red a little bit better. Um, let me know what you think in the comments below. Please comment, rate, subscribe, like, and share. Leave feedback on if you grab these, if you're paying over retail, if you got them for retail, um, if you pass or if you're planning on copping later this year. And yeah, um, like I said, I do like these. Um, I suggest that if you can get these, you should grab them because I think they're a nice shoe and the quality is better than what is expected. And that's about it. And if you want to stay tuned, um, there would be on foot.